Problem number 24. How many students must be randomly selected to estimate the mean weekly earnings of students at one college? So the question is asking for the sample size. So whenever you have one of these questions, as you read through it, you should look for what's called the margin of error. Right? They have to give it to you. It's typically one of the only numbers they give you. So let's see. We want to be 95% confident. So that's important. 95% that the sample mean is within five of the population mean. Okay, that's the margin of error. So E is five. And the population standard deviation is 63. That's sigma. So sigma in this case is the population standard deviation. Okay, whenever they give you the margin of error, you always have to multiply it by two in these problems, right? So this is two times five, so it's 10. And because they're giving us the population standard deviation, we're going to use z in this problem to do the problem. Okay, So we're going to use z in StatCrunch. So we go to stat, z stats, one sample, and then we have the width and we're looking for the sample size. Whoops, I think I picked the wrong one. Did I think I, yeah, no, I picked the right one. Let me just do it again. <laughs> Stat, Z, one sample, with sample size. Yeah, it's good. Okay, the level is okay. The standard deviation is 63. And the width is 10. The width is 10. Everything else looks okay. So confidence level, standard deviation, width. Compute. The answer should be 610. Let's check to make sure it's one of the choices. And it is. The answer to this problem is B. That's it.